And we are back on the frenzy. Defensive backs in our area, no. Catching up with Dallas Town wideout Kenny Johnson is easier said than done. Luckily, he sits down when our own Alex Cauley finds him. Kenny talks about his verbal commitment to Pitt and how the college coaches, they just keep on calling. High school football season right around the corner. The Friday nights will be back and glowing bigger and better than ever. District 3, as always, has plenty of talent, and one of the top talents in the area, the state, and the nation is here with us today. Kenny Johnson, Dallas Town. Thank you so much for your time. Really appreciate it. Of course. Appreciate it being here. You made plenty of headlines already uh, with the, the, the verbal to pit. First yeah. off, what was it about the Panthers that you like so much? Um, I just got there and I was vibing with the coach, um, Coach Underwood, that's my guy, uh, best receiver coach that I interacted with. Um, I talked to a lot of coaches and I mean it is tough, you know what I mean, you build those relationships with so many different coaches, but me and his were the strongest and I really love Coach Dudes and my, my parents loved it so they got all, all my, my checks boxed off. Did you anticipate making this decision before the season? Was, this, was there a schedule that you were trying to go with here? Right, yeah, no, it's always been my plan to be committed before this season because I wanted to be locked into where I wanted to go and I figured that, that was all the time I really needed to make a true decision on what I wanted to do. What is it like having that decision out of the way? Because, you know, everybody thinks, oh, they're getting all these scholarships, that's so cool. But it's also stressful because you're going through high school too, you got class. How, how much of a relief is it having that out of the way? Um, honestly, I wish I could say it was a relief. It's, it's, it's a lot more now, to be honest. You're getting a lot more calls. A lot of people don't see that, you know what I mean? After you commit, since it's a verbal commitment, other schools are really trying to get you to come back to their school and so, I mean, it's, it's been a little rough, but it is, it's the process. You gotta trust it, follow it. We mentioned there's a, there's a lot of top talent in District 3. Some you'll see on Friday nights, some you won't. I know you're busy on Fridays, obviously, but you see some of these kids in camps and on tape. What's a student athlete out there that you, you really enjoy watching their film? Uh, definitely Jaheim, definitely Jaheim. He, uh, he's explosive. He break tackles, he never let the first person get him down, and I always have a fun time. I only got to play him once, but this year will be fun too. I know uh, College Game Day just announced where they're going to be going for the first week. It'll be the backyard brawl, obviously. Pitt, Jaheim, Verbal to, to West Virginia. Yeah. You've got no saying what the schedule is going to be like, but how, how nice would it be to be able to play him on that next level? <sighs> Uh, just so exciting, you know what I mean? You switch from high school, then you go to college, the speeds change, and I think it'd be great. I think it'd be super exciting and we get to play each other in the biggest stage. Okay, now we're, we're getting ready for a new season here. At Dallas Town's gearing up. You've already had a camp. What is it like? Yeah, obviously, new head coach with, with Coach Murphy, a familiar face around the area, but you know, what's the vibe around Dallas Town right now? A good vibe right now, especially with the players, the coaches. Coach Murphy's doing a great job, you know what I mean? Just jumping in and, I mean, it's a lot of pressure to just jump in, especially this young. I mean, I couldn't do it, so. You're, uh, we, we talk about, you know, playing well on Friday night, but, you know, obviously you guys want to look good too. You got some, some retro, some homage, and the, the new helmets coming out. Yep. What's the reaction from the Wildcats and the new look here? Hey, we're liking it. Um, we're loving it, so we can't wait to pop out for the first game in a new uniform. It'll be exciting. 